information. Mining engineer. Demolitions Class C. Report to Parker Sector. Fun ride? Yeah. A blast. How's Mom? She misses you. Sorry I missed Dad's funeral. Things here have been... hard. No one expected you to come halfway across the system. What was that? Well, the EDF. They own the road and everything else. Forget the propaganda. Free Mars is over. Come on. Which faction? Didn't enough people die the last time? We're under martial law here. Prison camps. Torture. Death squads. People need something to believe in. Well, this is it. I've got your gear over there. So here's how it works. It'll be a couple of weeks before you... ...wait here. Like I was saying, the sooner we get to work, the sooner we get paid. Come on. Here's the site I was telling you about. It was a research outpost once, before the Marauders killed the scientists. Marauders? You don't want to be caught out here after dark. But it's a good place to find salvage. I'm here to mine, not hunt for scrap. On Mars, scrap is like gold. Got your sledgehammer and charges? Good. Let's see what you can do. Shit. Up in the sky. EDF gunship. Didn't think they'd be out here today. I'll keep an eye on it. You get the salvage. See that salvage on the ground? Pick it up so we can trade it. Use your remote charges and take down that big structure right there. Right now you can set two charges before you detonate them. Remember, you can swap weapons and still use the detonator. Come back to me if you run out of charges. Hurry up, Alec. Dan, what the hell is going on? Who's the girl? You know what's going on. Alec. The Red Faction could really use a guy like you. To do what? What are you people doing out here? Whatever it takes. I'm not a terrorist, Dan. You think I am? The EDF are wiping out towns. Alec, we need help. Hey, you got me into enough trouble Earthside. I just want to do honest work here. That's 
what we're fighting for. If we don't resist, they'll take everything. Enough. You'll see I'm right about this. We need to hide. From what? Daniel Mason, you are under arrest. Surrender or we will open fire. Alex, run! Run! Earth's Defense Force changed the face of Mars. They terraformed so we could breathe the air. They built bases, checkpoints, watchtowers. The Liberators soon became an occupying force. And now they killed my brother. Dan said they take everything. For me, they already have. Drop the weapon, now! <laughs> You guys afraid of a hammer? Drop it, smartass. Hey, what right have you got to trash Your my- Your brother is Daniel Mason. Yeah, he was. He's dead. This trailer and its contents have been confiscated by the Earth Defense Force. We're placing you under arrest. For what? Don't play dumb with me, Miner. You're Red Faction. <laughs> Look, I just shipped here from- I guess you work fast. We found these detonators among your possessions. I'm a mining engineer. I have a permit for the- It just got revoked. Shoot him. Red Faction. 
Like it or not, Mason, you are now. Mason, my name is Simonia. I worked with your brother. <laughs> Lucky you. I know this is a lot to take in, but you're going to have to trust us. Why? Because you don't really have any other option. The commander thought you should have this field manual. It'll help you survive out here. Welcome to the Red Faction. We'll start off with the basics. There are six populated sectors on Mars. Parker, Dust, Badlands, Oasis, the Free Fire Zone, and Eos. All of which are controlled by the Earth Defense Force. Our goal is to liberate all six sectors driving the EDF off the planet. There's only one problem. The EDF is a professional military organization. They've got the money, the training, and the firepower to take us down. Direct assaults are suicide. We need to hit their weak points, attack them when they least expect it, destroy high-value targets, and then get the hell out of there. If you ever need to hide from the EDF, restock ammo, or choose a different set of weapons for your field work, safe houses are set up throughout the world. Any available safe house will be marked on your map. Good luck. We don't have access to the same supply lines as the EDF. We can steal their guns, but that's not enough. Sam is an engineer working for the Red Faction. She's come up with ways to improvise weapons from mining equipment and industrial tools, but she needs raw materials. That's where salvage comes in. When you destroy things, you'll often see salvage on the ground afterward. Collect it and bring it to Sam. The more salvage you supply her with, the better the equipment she'll be able to provide. Abandoned buildings are good sources of salvage, as are any of those high-tech EDF structures. Bring them down and bring the salvage to Sam. They just shot that kid in the street and no one did anything! You need anything else? Let me know. Jungles and blue oceans are still years away. We are slowly bridging the gap between Earth and Mars. A recent study shows that production on Mars... ...is unable to keep pace with Earth's Japan. I've so many people, I don't even feel it. Mason, this is our former base of operations. We had to clear out before the EDF discovered it. Now we just need to cover our tracks. I know you're familiar with demolition, so maybe you can help us out. We need that building destroyed. Blow up anything that the EDF could trace back to us. Think you can handle it? This will be a piece of cake. We're transmitting the base coordinates now. Got it. I'm on my way. Uh... Davies. Hugo Davies. How'd you get caught up in this? The mining conglomerates found a huge ore deposit beneath our colony and tried to force us off the land. When we resisted, the EDF rolled in. It was a massacre. I'm sorry. I found refugees from other colonies and our numbers grew. Your brother joined us soon after.
always Dan's problem. He couldn't run from a fight. If there were more like him, we'd have a chance of winning this thing. Maybe. at the base. Good. Use whatever you can to bring her down. We left some fuel tanks behind. You can shoot them or set charges to blow them up. heading your way. I'd hurry up and finish the job. You said this was going to be easy. This was gonna be easy! Same definition of easy as you. I know you're angry, but we don't have the luxury of playing it safe. Your brother understood that. Mason, we need your help. There's new info in your guerrilla handbook that will be useful. The EDF's hold on each sector varies. Bring up your map to see the control value for each sector. Successfully completing guerrilla actions like raids drives control down. So does destroying EDF property, which is shown in red on your map. We've identified targets that are key to EDF operations. The ones marked as medium importance cause a bigger control drop when destroyed. A few are marked as high importance. Those require some planning before you hit them and will turn into a hornet's nest when you do. But the payoff is big. Each sector also has missions which are required for liberation. Drop the control to zero, complete all the missions, and the EDF will pull out. If we're going to defeat the EDF, we need the support of the people. To do that, we have to raise morale in each sector. 
Morale goes up as you complete guerrilla actions, destroy EDF propaganda, and a few other things you'll discover along the way. However, when a colonist is killed, that sector's morale drops, so be careful. As morale in a sector increases, ammo crates will be better stocked and colonists will begin to fight alongside you. Also, the amount of salvage you get for completing a mission will increase if morale in the sector is high. Higher morale means more ammo, more help, and more salvage. Three crucial elements we need to succeed. to your surroundings and use what's in front of you. Oh, and make sure you're out of the blast radius.
like and share if you enjoy the video and think others might benefit from this. And of course, subscribe and hit the notification button if you are new to the channel and want to be notified every time I post a video.